Well, today was a special one for all of our Next Star TV stations as a day of giving back. Dozens of WGN and News Nation employees taking part in this Founders Day of Caring, including WGN's Erin McElroy, and she's here with that story. Yep. Still have your outfit on. T-shirt to prove it, <laughs> yeah. Micah, yep. Yeah, you know, week after week I get to share all these stories of people putting good out there in the world, so it was great to see our station be that story today. Be part of making Chicago a better place for everybody. Go Nextstar! Starting bright and early, dozens of Nextstar employees threw on their Founders Day of Caring t-shirts and went to work. We've got people here from WGN TV, WGN Radio, from News Nation. This is wonderful to see so many people out here participating in this Founders Day of Caring. More than 75 employees spent the day packing clothes and school backpacks at Trails to Crayons, Chicago's Giving Factory. We've got 252 backpacks in this one. Great, and how much in here? Executive Director Don Milkiori says their goal to ensure all children have access to clothing, shoes, and school supplies relies entirely on the work of volunteers. Without our volunteers, we couldn't actually fulfill our mission. This last year, Cradles to Crans provided bags full of clothes to more than 300,000 children in Chicago. A lot of people don't realize it's right in their own neighborhood. You know, the child next door from you is struggling, you know. You're choosing if you're going to be able to afford a month full of diapers for your baby or pay your utility bills. So these are really difficult issues that people are trying to work through on their daily life. And we're here just to make sure that they know somebody's there to help them. By this afternoon, Nextra employees had packed bags for more than 4,000 Chicago kids. So we're grateful to our, our corporate leaders for Perry Sook for coming up with this idea 28 years ago and for giving everybody the opportunity to take four hours out of their day, uh, out of their work day, to come down here and contribute to the community. Back at WGN, dozens more gave back by signing up to donate blood to the American Red Cross of Illinois. There are so many different reasons why someone could need blood, and hosting these blood drives is the way that we get people in the community out to donate blood to make sure that the hospitals have the product that they need. In total, more than 34 units, saving approximately 102 lives, were collected from today's Founders Day of Caring. I just felt that it was something that I could do, so why not do it? It's so precious, it's so necessary, and I wanted to be a part in helping someone else. A day of giving in hopes of leaving Chicago a better place for everyone. Please don't leave so Please don't leave those tech out. When, as journalists, you know, we report on these nonprofit organizations and intimately know the impact they have in the community. Yeah. So it was really great to be able to have a day mm -hmm. we can give back. For sure. Good yeah. for you going out there. Yeah. Thank you very much. So we'll, we'll post a link because there's a there's a whole reach there with the Founders yeah. Day of Caring. Yeah. So we'll post it on our website for you guys. Amazing yeah. how everybody comes together for that. Appreciate it, Aaron.